So this is a message that, you know, there is so much beauty to be found no matter what environment you're in right now. I'm just in a typical American suburb. Nothing really special about it. And even here, you know, it's fall right now, so you know the colors of the leaves changing. The nice wood fence right there. It's just a fence, but it looks pretty nice. These little bushes with this nice little fence thing right here. All of the green on the lawns. The people playing baseball over there. All of the leaves kind of falling on the ground as the season begins, as we're going through the season right now. Hearing the leaves crunch as you walk over them, that nice sound that they make. <clears throat> the, even the fire hydrant, like I'm walking past a fire hydrant right now. It's just a nice little splash of red. Just a fire hydrant, but it looks nice. Look at this pond over here. Look at that tree over there with the things that hang down. I think it's called a willow tree. The house with that new deck over there. These rocks. That elementary school over there. Looking at the bricks with the green roof. Even just that parking lot, that's a bunch of black, but looking at the contrast of the cars and the parking lot. There really is just so much to be found no matter where you are. And looking at all these colors, the trees. I guess it's a message that, you know, really try to appreciate the what your environment does have to offer, what your town has to offer. So many people, and you know, for myself for a long time, would just look at what you didn't have and the fact that, oh, this is just some small town in the middle of the cornfields of rural Illinois. There's nothing to do out here. Do I have a beautiful sunset painting the sky right now? Not really, look at this. <laughs> gray overcast there's no sun painting the sky right now of course some beautiful sunset with all different colors do i have a bunch of mountains lining the horizon no flat plains of the midwest do i have the warm air or tropical weather of places near the equator no i still have to wear some layers here do i have that nice salt water filled atmosphere air or you know some place by the ocean no there's not much here but compared to you know other environments but even still there is still so much to be appreciative about to be thankful for to really stop and look at Look at that. Look at that fence, the contrast of color with that fence. I don't know if this is <laughs> a little weird or, you know, most people already do this or maybe it's just not really that special, but it's something that I really, I really love to do.